Welcome to the We On podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we explore how Raphael, the company behind Iron Dome and the new Iron Beam laser weapon, rose from a small research unit to one of the most powerful names in global missile defense, revealing the breakthroughs, battles, and bold innovations that turned it into a world leader. This transformation traces back to the nation's early days. For more than seven decades, Raphael Advanced Defense Systems has evolved from a modest post-independence research unit of Israel into one of the world's most influential defense manufacturers. The company, which was established in 1948 under Israel's Ministry of Defense, has steadily transformed into a global leader in interception technology, precision weapons, and integrated battlefield systems. Its breakthroughs, most notably Iron Dome, David's Sling, the Trophy Active Protection System, and the newly operational Iron Beam laser weapon, have reshaped modern air and missile defense. Its systems today are deployed by dozens of militaries, including 20 NATO members, and are credited with some of the highest real-world interception rates ever recorded. According to the official website, Raphael's ascent began with Israel's early security challenges, which required indigenous, rapidly adaptable solutions. Over time, the company developed expertise in missiles, electro-optics, guidance, propulsion, and later, cyber and AI technologies. Its first global breakthroughs of the company came through innovations such as the Python air-to-air -air missile and the Trophy Active Protection System the world's first operational anti-tank defense for armored vehicles. The company's flagship achievement is Iron Dome, developed with U.S. backing and now regarded as the world's most successful short-range interception system. The Tamir missile destroys incoming rockets, artillery shells, and UAVs with success rates above 90%. David Sling, designed to intercept medium-range ballistic and cruise missiles, and the Spider family, offering protection up to roughly 160 kilometers, have created a multi-layered air defense portfolio now exported or sought after worldwide. These systems have shaped global thinking on missile defense, prompting several countries to develop or attempt their own Iron Dome-like systems. Its newest milestone, is Iron Beam, a high-energy laser interceptor intended to counter rockets, mortars, and UAVs at near-zero cost per shot. According to Raphael, the system became operational around late 2024 to early 2025, representing the world's first functional integration of high-energy laser interception into national air defense architecture. Iron Beam is designed to complement Iron Dome, providing an economical solution to mass launch threats where interceptor stockpiles may be strained. It now supports customers across 20 NATO states and operates through 30 subsidiaries and joint ventures worldwide, according to the company. Its technologies are deployed across the US, Europe, the Asia Pacific, Latin America, and Africa, reinforcing its status as a world leader in missile defense, electro-optics, autonomous systems, and advanced guidance. Raphael's portfolio includes advanced aerodynamics, missile systems, autonomous platforms, electro-optic targeting, AI-powered command systems, RF technologies, cyber capabilities, and even quantum-based innovations. This wide technological base enables rapid adaptation, turning emerging scientific advances into deployable operational systems with unusual speed. With more than 10,000 employees and thousands of subcontractors, it is now one of Israel's largest and most strategically important defense companies. Its systems remain combat-proven, highly exported, and essential to modern military strategy, particularly in an era shaped by drones, saturation attacks, and precision threats. Thanks for tuning in to this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.